video we have Amazon Fire 7 inch tablet 2019 uh, the tablet is not working customer brought this tablet with not working so I have disassembled the tablet and I already have the motherboard on the holder and then I'm going to remove the all charging port put some uh, solder antic flux on the port and then bring the heat gun with the soldering iron so this will uh, make less heat to the motherboard I'm going to put uh, low melt solder it's to make the job easier to the charging port to be removed easily and faster no need to make a lot of heat to the motherboard now continue heating with the heating soldering iron and heat gun to remove the old board port has been removed after that I'm going to resolder the pads on the motherboard Now bring the new charging port and solder the pins on it and get ready to put it on position. Heat for a few seconds then bring and put the new charging port as you can see it's somehow different from the old one or the original one but this one is very very cheap like the old one and it's fit perfectly I have about 100 charging port models so I have looked to them and see whatever is the same and can put down without any problem and this one was uh, like it's the good one from the way I'm looking uh, the charging board doesn't fit correctly it seems that uh, it's not straight 
So I'm going to make sure it's fit on place correctly. I'm going now to flip the motherboard to make sure why the charging port is not straight. Okay, this is solder low melt solder. It uh, can uh, burn for about two uh, two fifty Celsius degree. Let's use the heat gun again. I'm going to make sure that the port is connected carefully and on straight position. Okay. I'm going now to work with the board like this. I can't see when it's fit. I'm going just to work from this position. You will see when the board can be fit correctly. You should be able to see that. You see now the charging board is connected perfectly but there is a bridge to the pin to the last pin and to the one beside it I'm going to remove to remove this bridge I'm always using this way to remove the bridge from the charging port pins and pads I'm going after that to re-solder the pads to make sure the solder is reached to every pins and pads and that's it. I want to I want the pads to be very very solid. Okay, seems all perfect. I'm going to clean up and then I will test. Now you can assemble and test. I'm always testing uh, the charging port with the multimeter before assemble. But uh, I don't know why didn't I do that. I just assemble it and put the charger on and the tablet is working. Okay, that was for today. If you have any question, just write it down in the comments below. 
if you like this video don't forget to support the channel by like and subscribe we will do something else in the next video peace